Hey guys, how you doing? Um, today I'm going on a couple calls. Thought I would try to take you with me. Um, I know uh, one of the calls, the guy's got a, says his uh, furnace isn't starting up. So I'm going to try and get some good video on that. And, uh, and then I got a lady uh, over in South Sacramento area says that um, she's got a she can't feel any airflow to her daughter's room and um, fortunately for me the ductwork is under the house so we're gonna go for a crawl later all right I just thought I'd bring you along today okay here we have a gas valve not energizing seems like we're not getting voltage from the control board because my hot surface igniter goes but I'm not getting voltage from the control board to the gas valve and the hot surface igniter goes out so <clears throat> we're gonna change this control board and see if that's it Try and fire this up and just replace the control board. Inducer's going. Hot surface igniter. Had to replace that. Let's see if the gas valve fires up. Okay, let's check this out. Try it again. New control board. Wasn't giving me 24 volts to the gas valve before. Now I have a new gas valve. I put in a new flex Petra or a sediment trap in to the ga new gas valve. have fire okay let's get a fan going here okay we got our fan on now Right. Well, I mean, that was a good call for us. Uh, we we uh, ended up changing out the control board. 
whereas I knew I didn't have 24 volts before. And then uh, once I changed out the control board, I now I have 24 volts to the gas valve, but the gas valve wouldn't light. So uh, changed out the gas valve, added a uh, you know some sediment trap, and um, got the system up and running. Did a temp split, was running a little bit high. Temp split was running a little bit high, um, around 50 degrees. But I went downstairs and checked out his filter and it was caked. So, people, change your filters. Change it. Every month or two, especially in the wintertime, especially in the summertime, change your filters. Because it slows down the air going through the furnace or, uh, and then, uh, so it, it causes it to heat up. And then that, that causes problems on other parts of your system, like your heat exchanger or, you know, uh, high temp limit switch will trip because it's too hot. And now you got a service call just because you didn't change your filter. No worries, I don't mind coming out. Uh, okay, well, now I'm heading over to Bare Bones Workwear to get me some coveralls because I need, uh, I'm gonna go, uh, sorry, driving. Because, uh, we're, because we're gonna go crawl under a house in South Sacramento. Woohoo! I'm looking forward to it. I love duct work under house, don't you? Belly crawls. Yeah, good times. That's why we do this. Uh, so, I'm going to take you there with us. I'm going to do some crawling with you. It'll be like you're crawling, but you won't really be crawling. <laughs> Alright. See you then. Okay, well, that was a pretty easy call with the duck job. Um, um, she said she wasn't having any airflow to her uh, daughter's bedroom. So, we went in there and we just located the register and um, uh, it was covered up by a bookshelf and the register was closed. So uh, I just turned on the fan on the thermostat and then we, uh, and once we moved the bookshelf and we opened up the register, it was flowing. Like it was, it had plenty of airflow to it. So they're gonna give that a shot. I'm pretty sure there's nothing wrong with the duct. Uh, under the house. I was able to sign them up as uh, club members on my uh, club membership program. So I told them, hey, if you'll sign, you know, like I want to, I'd like to come out for, you know, twice a year and uh, clean and maintain your system. So, uh, you know, being such a quick call, I just figured, hey, um, I'll waive today's, uh, you know, dispatch fee if you'll sign up on my club membership. That gives me a chance to go out there twice during the next year and I'm telling you guys it's like a uh, that thing's like a 25 year old gaffers and sattler downflow so I really want to get my hands on that system Ooh. all right okay well that was a good call